Hello, it is now day four of my vlogging every day challenge that I haven't posted one video of. Yay. Look, it's Shanley. She red now. That's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. You look like a uh, fucking red ass cotton ball. <laughs> cheated on me? I made a flat ass spray. You cheated on me? You got Chick fil A without me? Wait, I'm just running to the boobs. I mean, to get some coffee. I'm gonna find So at this point, I was just trying on my clothes for Miami, which I did not end up wearing either of these outfits. But I was trying on stuff. That's why my room looks a mess because I was trying to pack and hurry up because I was leaving the next day. But. Yeah, it didn't really work out. Niggas, what they want. I see them looking. I'm just trying to have some fun. If you a big spender, yeah, not a pretender. These outfits were cute, but they're just not giving Miami. The other one was giving Miami a little bit, but this one is not giving Miami. So I'm going to wear these to something else. Okay, okay, bye. Hey, it's cold as fuck in my house, so I want to be cute, so I put on this outfit to be cute in my house, like, but yeah, I just realized I got my wig cap, but fuck it, um, I'm packing for my trip, I'm about to clean the fuck up, um, it looks atrocious in here, so I'll be back in a little bit, I'll show y'all me packing and all that good shit, but I gotta clean up first, my room. Alright y'all, so now I am getting my wigs together for the trip, I am just going through and adding some clothes. Roll up a wood in the rolls. They are rich, say that it's rented. Yeah. Know that it's tenant. Might suck him dry while he drive. Betty gon' pull up in Linux and he gon' spin it. She'll drop a dime on a dime. Then I'ma tell him good riddance. But come on, let's get it. I just hit Gucci and Finny. Fucked him out, it's fitted. Then hopped in a sprinter and sprinter. So I'll just voice over through the rest of this because I stopped really focusing on filming for sound and stuff because I did my nephew's hair. I had to stop in the middle of what I had going on to do his hair after I was done packing for my trip. So this is how I ended my night and this is really it. I spent the day doing my wigs for the trip, um, packing and doing my nephew's hair because I woke up late. And yeah, um, next video, you'll see me packing the car up and getting ready to go out of town. This one is literally so short, but the only reason I'm posting it is because I got to stick with the everyday thing. So yeah, you guys getting four and five today.
and I have a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of content with Rev Air coming out. So I also wanted just you guys to see how nice this product is and how well it works on kids. He's not even trying to fight me for real. It worked. It blew his hair out for the braids that I did. And I'll show you guys the braids right at the end of this video because I literally blew his hair out for two hours or maybe like an hour. And then I took another hour to like braid it up for his school, first day of school. So hope you guys enjoy. And definitely shop Rev Air if you have a kid that needs freaking manageable hairstyles and that doesn't like getting their hair done and doesn't like loud noises and all of that stuff. This is really, really beneficial for that type of stuff. It was like no tears, no tension, no tenderheadedness. He literally just sat there and took it the whole time. So I believe that this is the easiest way that you could ever blow dry a kid's hair. Take it from me because I do this kid's hair all the time. <laughs> this was the easiest way I've ever done it. So... Get a rev air, guys. Tell them Chrissy sent you. <laughs> Y'all hear shit coming in now? <laughs> Okay. 